YouTubers and YouTube ads. Today's vlog is about why you should always have a slingshot. Okay, you want to have a slingshot. A hostile guy could come upon you and be like, Hey, yo, fool, I want all your money. And you know what? You're like, You're not going to know how to react to something like that. So, if you had a slingshot, which is not illegal to have in public, I don't think so. You could use it to defend yourself. Just make sure you got some ammo. A few rocks might do. You know what I'm saying? You could use a golf ball, which could possibly make blood clots form on whoever you're shooting at. Um, or use something that... Wait, you know what? Give me a sec. I got some rum in the microwave, so I'm just going to... Ah, ah, ammo. No, don't carry anything too dangerous now. You might end up, you know, piercing someone's spleen or even just tearing through their whole body. We can go DBZ in here, you know. Watch out! Watch out! Ow! <laughs> now, me personally... I personally would use a slingshot. I don't know if it's legal or illegal. Man, these things are hot. Anyway, any kind of slingshot would do, but you want to make sure you got some power. If you guys ever played The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, you would see Link in his childhood stage shooting with a little wooden slingshot. Which you shouldn't even be that powerful. Come on, it's a wooden slingshot. How could that even hurt? How is he killing aliens with it? I mean, for real? Or monsters, dungeons, whatever it was. That's besides the point. Uh, what? Alright. I'm good. So, uh... Slingshots were legal. Tell me, would you guys use use them? You know, leave it in the comments below. I want to know what's your opinion on slingshots. And uh, I gotta finish my ramen. Forty five, forty five. Until next time.